welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to show you how to make uh, Italian chicken with mozzarella cheese and fresh tomatoes. So let's get started. Oh, please subscribe, Bonnie Myers, Crazy Good Food, ring the bell, ring the bell, and you'll get notification of all my new recipes I put on. Oh, and I did have to um, make a note for my video. I used chicken breast, which you were supposed to cut in half. So you can use three or four chicken breasts. So you would have, if you use three chicken breasts, of course you'd have six pieces. In the recipe, I totally cut the chicken wrong. So I have many small pieces of chicken, which I was trying to figure out when I was doing the recipe, how this chicken was not gonna turn out dry. And <laughs> when I thought about it, I'm like, oh, I was supposed to cut the chicken breast in half. So anyway, that's my correction on my video. I made a notation um, in the video. So, good luck with the recipe. It was delicious even though my pieces were small. So, give it a try. Thanks. Okay, so we're gonna start by cleaning the chicken. We cut all that fat off of it. A teaspoon of oregano, a teaspoon of basil, four tablespoons of oil, Okay, now I'm going to let this um, in the refrigerator for about an hour and let it marinate. Okay, so I have a nice hot skillet. I'm going to take the chicken and then I'm going to fry it each side for two minutes and I'm going to put it into a baking dish. Okay, I'll just do a minute and then we'll just put it over. We've got like some brown bread. So now I'm going to make the sauce for the chicken. Okay, it's balsamic vinegar, garlic, onion, and brown sugar. Okay, then I'm going to whisk this all together. I'm just getting this all together. So I whisk the sauce. I'm going to put them in the hot pan. And I'm going to simmer this for about two to three minutes. And let it simmer.
Okay, so we're going to put the chicken back in the sauce. Some of the juice all over it. There's the juice. So now it's going in the oven at 350 for 10 minutes. It comes out of the oven. We're going to top it with thin, thin slices of tomato. My handy dandy sharp knife really makes it easier. Okay, so when the chicken's done in the oven, we're going to top it with um, mozzarella cheese and we're going to put it under the broiler and let that melt. Now this could be shredded, this could be uh, slices of mozzarella, any type that you prefer. I just happen to have this. Um, you don't even have to use mozzarella but I think it would taste delicious with it. You can use any, any cheese of your preference. Okay, so looks beautiful. This is my garden vegetables. Okay, so now we're going to put mozzarella cheese on top of the chicken. And it's going under the broiler to that melts. Okay, so now we broil these. Mm -hmm. We're going to put a slice of tomato on each and put them back in the broiler. Yeah. 